Hey, welcome back. My name is Phoebe. I'll be guiding you through uh, the next short power sequence. Uh, a lot of twists today um, should leave feeling grounded and energized. We'll get started on our backs. You'll make your way to your back. Allow one hand to graze your belly, one on your heart space. Close down your eyes. Draw your big toes and heels together to touch, knees wide open towards the edges of your space. Breathe in. Sigh out, feel your belly button fall towards the earth. A few more times like that. Inhale through your nose, start to feel your belly swell and expand. Exhale, sigh out. One more together. Fill up, belly puffs out. Exhale, empty it out. Feel your navel fall. Draw your lips together to touch. Press your toes into one another, your heels. Start to engage and lengthen through your back body. Breathe in. Out through your nose. Fill your mind, draw your breath and awareness right into this space. Carve out time for yourself to be present on your mat or whatever comes up. Let's take the next three breaths to notice what's living inside you today, how you feel. how you want to feel when you end practice. Stretch your toes away from your arms, fill up. Keep your lower body as is on your exhale, slowly reach your arms up towards the sky and then palms face down towards your thighs. We're gonna do that again. Inhale, lift your arms up. Tops of your hands touch the floor above you. Exhale for four, three, two, palms touch down. Inhale for four, fill your belly, three, two, back of your hands touch. Last one, exhale for four, three, two. This time start to lift your shoulders up off the earth. Lift your heels up off the earth. Little early core, glue your lower spine to the earth. And then chuck your knees in towards your chest. Rock side to side. Buck up and down. We'll meet in the tabletop position. Align your wrists underneath your shoulders, knees under hips. Look forward to generate a flat spine. Inhale, cow pose, drop your belly, shift your gaze up the front wall or palm tree. Exhale, curl and tuck, chin to chest, press the earth away. Inhale, cow pose, drop your belly, shift your gaze. Exhale, round, this time come all the way back to a modified child's pose, hips to heels. Walk your hands, just one handprint forward towards the front edge of your space so you have more length for your arms. And then inhale, snake through, but this time start to drop your hips down towards the earth. Modify up dog, breathe in. Exhale, round and curl, chin to chest. And then again, press your hips back. See if you can walk your fingertips even closer. Long stretch through your shoulders. Inhale, snake forward. Start to drop your hips as you open through your chest. Fill up. Exhale, curl, protect your back. Tuck chin to chest, and then set hips to heels. Last time, long spine. Inhale, snake through. Core is on, gaze up. Exhale, child's pose. And then tuck your toes, hips lift high, downward facing dog. Shake out your head, bend deeply through your knees, whether it's late at night, maybe early morning. 
Generate length through the back sides of your calves, your quads. Start to strengthen. Shrug your shoulders away to create a wider base and more space for your ears. Shake your head. Press away with all 10 finger pads. Breathe in. Breathe out. Start to lengthen through your left leg. Inhale, lift your right heel high. Keep your toes pointed towards the ground. Lift from your inner right thigh. Breathe in. Exhale. Step your hands between your, step your feet between your hands. Inhale, easy twist. Reach up through your right side. Really light on your left side hand. See if you can drop your right thigh bone down. Good. Then release your left ear down towards your shoulder. Breathe in, nice neck stretch. Exhale, wrap your right bicep underneath your right thigh. Inhale, reach tall. Let's do that two more times. Exhale, wrap under. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, wrap. Inhale, lengthen. All 10 toes towards the right. Start to drop your hips down towards the mat. Inhale, reach tall, frame your right toes. Drop your back knee. Inhale, reach tall. On your exhale, open twist towards your right. Nice and easy, left hand grazes your right thigh. And then your right hand can do as it pleases. You can wrap around. You can reach for the back of your left hamstring like I like to do. Just a gentle twist, breathe in. And out. Inhale, reach tall. Exhale, frame your foot. Come onto your finger pads or blocks. And then half splits, Ardha Hanumasana. Hips draw over your heels. And walk your hands underneath your shoulders. Guide with your chest. Good, breathe in. Exhale, surrender over your right thigh. This can be really intensive. For those of us with tight hamstrings, tight IT bands. Inhale, lift. Left hand stays planted. Inhale, open twist through your right side. Good, squeeze your inner thighs. If you find imbalance, you can walk your right foot out towards the right side for a wider base. Breathe in. Rebend through your right knee, tuck your toes. Step back, down dog. Two breaths here, fill up. Sigh out. One more. Long spine release. Inhale, straighten through your right leg and lift your left toes up towards the ceiling. Press evenly through both finger pads or both hands. And then exhale, knee to nose, step through. Right hand stays planted. Inhale, lift your left arm high. Breathe in, stretch long. And then exhale, surrender your right ear towards your right shoulder. Stay active through your core, breathe in. Exhale, wrap your left arm around. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, arm underneath your left leg. Last time here, inhale. Exhale, wrap. Inhale, reach all 10 toes towards the left and then drop your right hip down towards the ground. Woo, IT band for that left side. Inhale, reach. Frame your left toes and then release your back knee down. Inhale, on jene, low lunge. Take time, find strength and balance. Breathe in 360 degrees. Exhale, open twist towards your left. Right hand grazes your left thigh. And then back hands can come towards your right hamstring. Breathe in. Slide your right hip lower, breathe out. Inhale, reach tall. Exhale, frame your foot. Half splits. <clears throat> Draw your left hip crease back like you could drag your left heel towards the back of your mat. And then push your right kneecap forward. Inhale. Exhale, negotiate your chest closer towards your extended thigh. Breathe in. Good. Slide your right hand underneath your shoulder if it's not there. Inhale, open twist. Again, squeeze through your inner thighs. You might find a few wobbles. If you do, walk that left foot over towards the left side of your mat. And then exhale, release. Rebend. Downward facing dog. Breath in. 
and out. Inhale, gaze up towards your hands. Exhale, travel forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Two more times. Inhale, flat back. Hands to lengthen the space from your breastbone to your hips. Exhale, bow. Once more. Inhale, flat back. Use your hands as leverage to extend your spine long. Exhale, bow. Inhale, rise. Come all the way up. Arms come up overhead. Exhale, hands to heart center to touch. Close your eyes. Breathe in. Root through the ball arms of your feet. Exhale, dip into that energy. Inhale, stretch your arms high overhead. Weight transfers to your left foot. And slowly open your eyelids. Tree pose. Foot comes towards the inside of your left thigh. You can use your hand to get there, or today try maybe just placing it wherever you can lift your leg. Good, breathe in. Reach for your right wrist, and then exhale, side bend over towards your left. Good, continuously pressing your right knee away. Inhale back through center, reach for your left wrist. Exhale, side bend over towards the right. Push your hips left, left, left. Inhale back through center. Connect your palms. Balance challenge to lift your gaze up your straight arm bones towards your fingertips. And then release. Back to center. Close down your eyes, breathe in. And out. Inhale, stretch your arms up overhead, open your eyes. Weight shifts to your right foot, and then left foot comes towards the inseam of your right thigh. Grow long through your right side, and then reach for your left wrist. Side bend over towards the right side. Open up through your left leg like a gate. Inhale, lift, reach for your right wrist. Exhale, over towards the left, push your hips right. Push, push, push. Inhale, back through center. Balance challenge, connect your palms. Ride your eyelids slowly up the front wall. Then up your arms, lift, lift, lift. If it's not there today, that's okay. And then come back down. Inhale, reach tall. Exhale, bow forward, fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, plant your palms, travel back to plank pose. Strong through the front side body. Inhale, shift forward to the tips of your toes. Exhale, come back. One more time, inhale, shift forward. Exhale, hover all the way down to your belly, nice and slow. Good, tops of your feet to the mat. Shrug your shoulders back, forehead placed down on the mat. Inhale, baby cobra, lift and look down and a little bit forward. Exhale, bow. Twice more, root into the tops of your toes. Inhale, draw your arms back like two wings. Exhale, bow. Last one here. Inhale, baby cobra. Press into the tips of your, or the tops of your toes. Exhale, back. Tuck your toes. Lift through your thighs, belly on. Inhale, press up high plank. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breath in. Breath out. Inhale, gaze up towards your hands. Exhale, travel forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Inhale, rise, stand all the way up. Tree pose, just for a breath in of balance. Exhale, bow, forward fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Inhale, tree pose, left knee. Bends, reach up. Exhale, bow, forward fold. Excellent work. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, plant your palms, travel back to plank pose. Inhale, shift to the tips of your toes, squeeze through your thighs. Exhale, come back. Inhale, tips of your toes, shoulders over your wrists. Exhale, hover halfway. Inhale, upward facing. Exhale, hips float high, downward facing dog. Shake out your head, breathe in. Sigh out. Inhale, gaze up towards your hands. Exhale, travel forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Inhale, rise, stand all the way up. Exhale, forward fold. 
Inhale, flat back. Exhale, plant your palms, travel back. Your vinyasa, high to mid. Inhale, up dog. You can remove the push up, you can add a few on. Exhale, down dog. One more time through. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel there. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Root to rise, stand up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, flat back, grow long. Exhale, plant your palms, travel back, high to mid. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Breath in, readjust. Breath out. Inhale, gaze up towards your hands. Exhale, travel forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Take your feet hip width distance apart. Hinge down into your hips. And then inhale to reach your hands high. Chair pose, our favorite. Make sure your knees are aligned behind your toes. Start to draw your pelvis down like you're tucking it under. Breathe and lift tall. Maybe even lift out a little bit of your depth today to make sure your tailbone is tucked under. Breathe in. Exhale, bow. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, plant your palms, travel back. High to mid. Up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Lengthen through your left leg. Inhale, reach your right heel high. Don't kick the cactus behind you, that will hurt. Breathe in. Exhale, draw knee to nose. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step through. Stay high on your back knee. Inhale, reach your arms tall. Crescent lunge. Our first one, so just negotiate your stance nice and strong. You can bend through your back knee and then re-lengthen and elongate through your back hamstring. Breathe in. Exhale, open twist towards your right. Fill up. Settle lower. Inhale, reverse. Stretch up and back. Exhale, chaturanga high to mid. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Straighten through your right leg. Inhale, left heel lifts. Exhale, draw knee to nose, hovering round. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step through. Stay high on your back knee. Square your hips. Inhale, reach tall through your arms. Lift up like your upper rib cage is pulling up. And then breathe fully. Fill up. Open twist towards your left. Right arm reaches forward. Left arm and hip track back. Breathe in. Exhale, left hand towards the back of your right thigh. Lift up. Breathe in. Exhale, chaturanga. High to knee. Inhale, upward facing. Exhale, downward facing dog. One breath in. Inhale, gaze up towards your hands. Exhale, travel there. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Inhale, flat back. Feet hip width distance apart. Exhale, chair pose. Stretch your arms long. I am sweating. Whew. Breathe in. Exhale, bow forward, fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, plant your palms, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, hips float high. You guys got to breathe in. Clear it all out. Once more like that. Inhale, stretch your right heel high. Exhale, draw knee to nose. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step through. Rise, crescent lunge, reach tall. Open up. Inhale, exalted, reverse. Exhale, stretch forward. And this time, skandhasana towards the back of your space. So bend into your left knee, and then right toes track up towards the ceiling or sky. You can stay rooted through your hands, or draw hands to heart center to touch. Lift your left or your right toes up towards the sky. Breathe in. Skandhasana towards the front of your space. Left toes up. Elevate through your hips. Good work. Breathe in. 
On your breath out, low lunge towards the front of your space. Bring your right toes. Inhale, three-leg dog. Exhale, cross body, knee to left elbow, touch. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, cross body, and kick through. Fall in triangle plank here. Make sure you're dragging your right heel back towards the back side of your mat. And then your shoulders are dragging forward. Good, breathe in. Fall in triangle, feet plant. Lift your hips high. You can even bend through your knees for this round. Inhale. Exhale, replant your hands. Kick your right leg high. Downward facing dog. Full breath in. Let it out. Inhale, left heel high. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, step through. Inhale, rise, crescent lunge. Exhale, open up. Inhale, exalted, reach up and back. Exhale, elongate forward, and then skandhasana towards the back of your space. Readjust back feet or back foot out 45 degrees. Shrug your shoulders down, lift through your heart. Breathe in and out. Inhale, skandhasana towards the front of your space. Left knee bends, right toes face up. Hands to heart center, fill up. One more. Exhale, low lunge towards the front of your space. Three leg dog, left leg lifts. Exhale, cross knee to right elbow. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, cross body, and then kick your left leg across. Drag your left heel back and your shoulders forward. Strong, strong, strong. Inhale. Exhale, fall in triangle. Flip your hips high. Reach your hand up towards the ceiling. Let the sweat drip in your eyes. Breathe in. Exhale, replace. Downward facing dog. Fill up. Shake it out. Gaze up towards your hands. Malasana yogi squat. Whew. It is humid AF here. Oh my. If you're sweating, you're not alone. I'm like literally trippy. Okay. Feet out, hips low. Close down your eyelids. Check in with your breathing. Probably heart rate is pretty high. And you regulate with a full belly breath. One more. Hands plant. Step your feet back to plank pose. Hips high, down dog. Breathe in, look forward. Exhale, step up or flip to the front. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, bow. Inhale, rise, stand all the way up. Inhale, reach your arms high. Exhale, gather your hands at your heart's base. Challenge to shift the weight to your left foot, keeping your eyes closed. And then find your right footprint anywhere on the inside of your left thigh. It can be at your calf. Root into the ball mound of your left foot. And find where's challenging for you in the darkness. All those little stabilizer muscles working. Breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, right knee comes to 90 degrees. Like you're stepping on a stage in front of you. You can reopen your eyes or power to you, keep them closed. Breathe in. Exhale, step your right foot towards the middle of your mat. Reach tall, square your hips. Exhale, forward fold over your left leg. Hands surround your left toes. Breathe in, pyramid pose. Exhale, bow. Navel through spine. Let your head release any tension of your jaw subside. Inhale, flat back. Right hand under your shoulder on a block or your fingertips. 
Inhale, lift and open through your left side. Square through your hips. Exhale, bow. Then pivot on your toes, all 10 toes towards the right side of your mat. You can get really wide, toes in, heels out, breathe in. A release. Again, you can sway your head, reach for the outer edges of your shins to lengthen your torso, your head away from your hip. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, back towards the front of your mat, step forward. Inhale, all the way up. Arms come up overhead. Exhale, gather your hands at your heart space. Weight transfers to your right footprint. Tree pose with your eyes closed for challenge. Wiggles, the wobbles. Let us know we're human. We struggle. And then we can find stillness wherever we are. Breathe in. And out. Gently reopen your eyes. Left knee to 90 degrees. Stretch long. Exhale, step your left foot, about halfway back your mat. Square your hips, pyramid toes, breathe in. Exhale, bow over your right leg. Square your hips, and then exhale, fold over your extended leg. Your head, drip long. Breath in. Align your left hand under your shoulder. Open twists, revolve triangle, breathing. Exhale, release. All 10 toes towards the left side of your space. Get a little bit longer with your stance. Fill up, exhale, bow. Opportunity to invert if you'd like to layer in a headstand. A twist. Reaching your opposite hand towards your opposite leg. It's going to feel really nice. We'll take two more breaths wherever you're at. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, lunge into your right knee and then step towards the front of your space. We'll come all the way down to our bottoms. We made it. Up your feet together to touch. And use your hands to open your feet like a book. Padakonasana. Breathe in. Exhale, round forward. Let your elbows splay out. Head can drop into that little opening in for the bottoms of your feet. And just let it hang if it doesn't touch yet. It's okay. Breathe in. Inhale, slowly rise. Zip your thighs together and then meet on your back. Keep your knees bent. Walk your feet in towards your hips so you can touch the backs of your heels. Just one set of bridge today. Back is flat on the earth. Inhale, lift from your hips. Lift, lift, lift. Maybe interlace your hands underneath your hips. Root down through your arm bones to open more space for your neck. Root down through your heels to tone through your glutes. Breathe in. Slow release. Come on down. Every part of your back touches. If it touches down, lift your feet up towards the sky. Happy baby, rock it out. You can reach for your shins and straighten your legs. Legs overhead. Whatever feels satisfying before Shavasana. Toes play out towards the edges of your space. Palms face up. Navigate shoulders away from your earlobes. Feel held in this space, safe. Collective breath in. Sigh of rest. 
Shavasana. Time permits, please allow yourself to stay here, to rest and nourish. If you'd like to move on, reach your arms overhead. Start to expand your breath deeper in towards your lungs. Fill up. And then exhale, wrap around your shins. Wrap up and down the length of your spine a few times meet in a seat. Draw your hands to heart center to touch. Lengthen through the back of your spine. Tap into uh, this aliveness, the energy uh, that you've created, crafted. Hopefully the feeling that you wanted to leave with sits with you right here today. After all your hard work, breathe in. Empty out. Namaste.